The police are looking for me. That's okay, it's not the first time that's happened. Oh, we can kind of hear the radio, that's crazy. But we never really tried using the sewers anyway, so this might be a good time to just, you know, get acquainted. Oh, there was that one place with the, um, the locked door that I never opened. It might have been, what was it? At the basement of Skyline? There was a manhole cover that I forgot to go to. So maybe that locked door goes there. Whenever we go back to Skyline, it might be a good idea to unlock it, if it is the same door. Because it'll be a nice place to get back home, right? A nice way. Yeah, give up, give up. Right, this door. Let's try going out here then. Jeez, man. Girl just trying to get a snack. Okay, this is not Skyline at all. Not Skyline at all. Hold on though, let me check. The taxi would be the way to go to the museum. Hop in. Oh, it isn't. I gotta go back to Prince probably. But you know what? Now that we have a lead on the carnival thing, the carnival of death, maybe it's a good time to go back to the pier because last time we went there and nothing happened too. Anyway though, while we're thinking about it anyway, why don't I go back to Skyline and try to um, unlock that one manhole cover? Is it this way? Oh, these guys are still stuck. What, what was that? I feel like I just saw something fly across the screen. Was it this way or I think it was this way maybe. I think so. I'm okay, I'm okay. Anybody need anything? No? Hmm. So we know from the radio and the TV that this killer person has already killed multiple people. But really, really brutally, which suggests that it's not just a simple, hey, I, I feel like killing somebody. Baby girl. You know I got what you need. Seems more targeted. Hey, hey, don't walk on by. I look like D.I. Warwick. No, I don't want to sell any of these, right? But I'll sell the morphine. The club me sick. Shh, shh, Larry, shh. Yo, 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 I got dinosaur Wish I could sell the book. We don't know what kind. Those Buy are valuable, you know? Yo, yo, koala ears. Lazy Fancy ring. Dwarf saddle right here. Check it out, check it out. Step drug right box. Up. Can I sell the drug box? No. David Duchovny sick. Signed, sealed, and certified. Okay, okay, cool. That's hey, very hey, cool. Don't walk on by. I look like D.I. Warwick. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, whatever. Bye. Who did that? That was the same garbage can that was in the middle of that place, right? <laughs> They've knocked it all the way out into the streets. How are the cars gonna get by? If we want to go in the basement, oh, this guy's gonna make a fuss again. The easiest way... The pacifist way would be to go back into my house and then go into the vents. But probably what we can do is... This. Oh, shoot! Well, I guess we're not gonna have a security guard in our building anymore. Which is perfectly fine because I didn't need one anyway. <laughs> that guy's blood never regenerated, what gives? Oh, cause that's... That was my second time sucking the guy dry. And I lost humanity. Oh well. Oh well. <laughs> what can we do? Yeah, well, hey, traveling down here is easier now. Thank God. Where's my place? Ah, the bodies are gone. That's probably a good thing, I suppose. God, this guy even had cameras in the bathroom. That's awful. Why did I come down here again? I came down here to um, find the manhole cover. There was a spot with a manhole cover. Yes. <laughs> Is that security guard gonna come back? Well, I don't regret killing him. That was the first time I accidentally killed somebody. He should be honored. Where the heck? Okay, this isn't where I thought we were gonna be. Where are we? Oh, this is behind confession? I think so. Oh. 
Then where's the locked door? What the heck is making that sound? Okay. This is access point C and D. Not the locked door at all. Like, at all. <laughs> so why did I do all of that then? I don't even know. It was, um, G, right? Access point G? I don't see it on the map. G. Eh. Oh well, whatever. If it's important, we'll... We'll figure it out, alright? Right now, we should probably focus on going back to... The Prince, LaCroix. And we're gonna be going on a mission to... The museum. Oh my god! I didn't know you guys patrol here. That's definitely news to me. Is it because you were trying to find me earlier? Oh my god. We're learning new things every day. It's completely freaking me out. <laughs> What the hell? Where- where are we? <laughs> Le corpse se levant. It's a really creepy photo. Oh! <gasps> Wait, who's making that sound? Is that me? Is this a theater where we were going to be executed? Hold on, how the hell- where are we? I've never- We've never been here before. What is this? I'm sure we'll have to come back for a quest or something, but wow, I- How the hell did we get in here? And how the hell do we get out of here? Oh, this has got to be the same theater, right? But was that downtown LA? Yeah, I guess so, because... Oh, that's not on. Because, uh, originally, what happened was... The event took place in downtown. Oh, I recognize this hallway! In the very beginning, right? In the first cutscene. And then out here was where we saw Jack for the first time, I think. Yeah, this computer's on. Oh, this is Nocturne Theater! Oh, that's right! That was a place on the map, but we never... We never saw the door. Somehow. I'm not sure why we're here, but who cares? Let's read some emails. Four letter password to do with theater. Can we guess it? Play. No, no. Play. No. <laughs> okay, we'll just hack it. Fine. We'll just hack it. Noon. Nose. Nose? Nose? Spotlight. From sksp at company.vtm Did you leave the broken spotlight up on the railing? Someone will trip over it and break their neck. Put it in the workshop as soon as possible. I'll not stow that away for you. SKSP There's a broken spotlight. Sounds like an easy way to... Um, quote unquote, accidentally kill somebody. And kill somebody and make it look like an accident, even though it's not. Oh yeah, this has got to be um, a future thing for some other quest. There's also a ladder here. Which might be where the, um, the broken railing or spotlight or whatever comes in. A little bit empty though, because it is pretty late at night and nobody's really around. Hey, that one spot is lit up. That seems special. Oh hey! What the heck? Well, we can't do anything with it for now. Yeah, that's gotta be something for the future. Break something, kill somebody... Should we just... Good. Now why are we here? I don't know. We can't even get out of here. <laughs> it, it's so quiet here. It's so quiet. Probably because it's midnight and... Nobody goes to watch a play at midnight. Yeah, we'll leave it alone for now, and probably sometime later, we will revisit. Does that mean that if uh, if this was a theater where 
we were originally going to be killed. Then we were originally from downtown. Oh, I can't even get out here. What? I can't even get out the normal way. I gotta go back through the sewers? Okay. Okay. Uh, great. Great. Well, how the hell? Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. But where was this place normally on the map? We've definitely seen it before, but I don't remember coming across the door anywhere. Okay, well, that was a weird little adventure. If we want to find this place easier, we should remember the access point number or a letter. B. Access point B is how we go to that place again. A? A is where? I kind of want to go back to Santa Monica Beach again, the pier, to check out the place, just in case of its change, but probably the next step for that quest is going to Lucky Star, which we haven't heard before, so it's probably in some other town, which means right now I should probably just... Ooh. Cool cats. A taste to die for. Cigarettes. Come on, don't perpetrate that image of cigarettes being cool and all. Yeah, we should just go back to the prince now. Again, if we think about the big picture, things are getting really complicated and we don't know who's lying, we don't know what's really going on. Nines was acting really weird, but I'm not... Okay, there's a lot of different possibilities you can say about Nines. We don't know anything right now. And being a fledgling, we don't know how the rules of this world work, so that could have been an imposter, that could have been Nines, but something weird happened to him. That could have been anything. Yeah, you go right on up and see Mr. LaCroix. Huh. All these monitors and not one of them gets chips. But we can't verify anything because we can't speak to him. I'm a little bit surprised Nines wouldn't come speak to me though. If everybody was so mad about how I supposedly sold him out, then he should be like, hey man, what the hell, fledgling? The car is waiting. I'm ready to go, but I had a few questions first. One or two, but that's all. How does Bach know you? My history with that family dates back to Bach's grandfather, who pursued me into Africa, where I killed him. Bach's father tracked me to London to meet his death. And now Bach and the Society of Leopold have followed me across America. They never learn. Society of Leopold? Wow, you're like a family heirloom or something. You're a family tradition. Son, when you grow up, you gotta go kill this vampire called LaCroix, okay? <laughs> The Society of Leopold? Witch hunters. An anachronistic holdover from the Middle Ages. They are inquisitors whose fanaticism has convinced them that their triumph over the supernatural will save mankind and secure them a cushy spot in heaven. What's a blood hunt? A blood hunt is a death sentence. When one commits a high crime against our society, a blood hunt may be called. It is then the responsibility of the city's kindred to bring the offender final death. Of course, that would only apply for people that believe in the Camarilla. But I find it hard to believe that, for example, Strauss would hear about this and be like, Hey, I'm gonna go kill Nines now because LaCroix said so. So I'm not sure who's actually executing your blood hunt. Lower level Camarilla? People like me? I see. I'm ready to go to the museum now. There is a degree of immediacy attached to this task. Work fast. And, as on the Dane, you are not to open the Ankaran sarcophagus for any reason. Excuse me. What? Why do you keep emphasizing that? Stop. You just make me want to open it more and more. Okay. The car is waiting. Oh, no. I always think that you'll just bring me there directly, but I gotta go back to the taxi. <laughs> I'm ready to go. There is a degree of a- Okay, I will see you... when I come back, I guess. Oh god, another mission where we can't kill people. And we gotta be sneaky. And we gotta not alarm the public. No one's even in the museum at night. There shouldn't be anybody. Going somewhere? Museum, between Santa Monica and downtown.
Why am I already... Hey. Well, I came in here in third person mode while holding a weapon. That's not a good sign. We can't go this way. We're... That looks a lot like the Tremere Regent's house. In fact, I'm pretty sure it is. Hi. Psychic reading by Madame Madame Leota. Due to unforeseen, though fortunate circumstances, the business of Madame Leota has been relocated onto the Santa Monica Pier. Oh, we've seen it before. It was next to that game arcade place. I thought we couldn't go in though. Oh, oh right, we have another task today. The prince would appreciate your taking the Ankaran sarcophagus from the museum and bringing it to him for safekeeping. And do it without killing anyone if possible. So this time, we gotta actually take it, not just look at it through a camera. But also, we are looking for a fetish in the museum, some kind of an occult item. Okay. Am I allowed in? I mean, it's pretty late at night. Hi. You're not doing a very good job. Oh, maybe you're like, uh, you're meant for me to take some blood. <gasps> Top off my blood, just in case. Thank you. Hey, there's you know whose car again. Ancient insects unlocking the secret secret of an ancient life. Coming in January. Dinosaurs. October to December. So right now it's dinosaurs. Because it's October. 24th? 25th? Sacrifice. A look into the long-standing tradition of human sacrifice. That's... Okay. Um... It feels like everything's so spooky all the time. Because I guess we're always happening... I hear footsteps. Well, we can't go in here. Yeah, because I guess everything is happening at night time, so it's like we're... I feel like we're doing a heist now. No one's here. The security guard outside was garbage. He didn't do anything. We'll come back and read that later. But uh, how do we... Oh, do we just go here? Yeah, there's an upstairs. Okay. Okay, forget about it. I was gonna read the museum admission prices, but I want to take advantage of my Auspex and not waste it. <laughs> oh! Jeez. Holy God. Who left this here? Damned funny. You scared the crap out of the cleaning crew. Now, would you put the damned raptor back in its exhibit? Oh, and don't leave your keys lying around or Marshall will fire your ass. Uh, it's a combat area, right? So if I try to suck him, he's probably gonna get mad at me. We either talk to him, or we avoid him. Fine. But LaCroix did say that deception is possible with mortals. So I'm really hoping that some of these people will... Let me talk to them. Whoa, he's moonwalking. Holy, why is it so scary here? We don't have a blueprint of the... This seems more like a dungeon than a museum. We don't have a blueprint of the museum, so I don't even know where we're going right now. But if I were a sarcophagus, I probably wouldn't be in the hallways. These hallways are dangerous. We don't know who's gonna walk out of the corner.
Roof access. We can't suck anybody though. I want to look around, but not while people are hunting me. We're at zero right now, we should be okay. Ooh! Otters? Is that an otter? Some kind of a deer? Ooh, 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 that guy has a gun, that guy has a gun. Okay, if anything goes south, we jump off the railing. I want to use Auspex more, but I don't... I'm scared about blood. If we run out, we do have a lot of blood packs. We should probably use some of them. Okay, the number's increasing, because that guy's coming this way. He's probably going to keep following me, so we got to make a loop around and try to... Um, maybe go up? I don't have time to look at these exhibits. I feel sad. I believe that got me twice. I'm basically glued to the number on my screen right now, hoping that it'll tip me off if we are about to be found out. Doesn't seem like there's anything on this, uh, this specific floor. Okay, we made one big loop, kind of. Octopus? This is the dinosaur section. There's no... We gotta go to the Egyptian mummy section. Which might be in the sacrifice section. No, this is a way to cut through. There's nothing here either. Oh, I wanna suck him. I wanna suck him so badly. Do we wanna go down? Whoa, it's really... What? Okay, I'm gonna make an executive decision here. I get the impression that maybe we're not trying to go to the bottom floor, but instead... You know that one place that we came from? Wherever it was? If only I could find it again. Uh, we should probably go clockwise, or counterclockwise, because that guy's pattern is counterclockwise. We wouldn't want to bump into him. I'm gonna go back to the place where it said roof access, because I feel like that's probably gonna be a bit more helpful. Or we can just kind of look down here. Yeah, there's like one door there, but I don't see any sarcophaguses. But we're also here looking for the fetish item. And I don't quite remember exactly what it was, like what kind of um, era, what kind of theme. But it might be in the Egyptian mummy section too, I'm really hoping. Uh, if we want to go to the roof access- Jeez, no. Where was the roof access? I've completely lost my way. Oh, this is... freaking fake. The hell? Now, I feel like we can walk around here. We just gotta be careful about that guy not being too close to us. But it is okay. Okay, fine, we're gonna have a look here anyway. Oh, that's gotta be... There's no room here. We had a hundred just now. Oh, there's a guy. Okay. I think there was only one guy. And it makes sense because it's late at night and why do normally do museums normally have people just wandering around like this? Oh, that's where we came from, I think. Okay, these doors have knobs.
Wait, what if there's someone in here? There is someone in here. Oh my god. Should I just go? What have I gotten myself into? I don't want to suck him though. Are you done? Okay, the vents. That makes me feel better. Where am I trying to go? What am I looking for? I do not know. He's gonna see me, he's gonna see me. I'm gonna save just in case. I don't want to do the whole thing again where we had to redo the entire parking lot. Oh my god. Looks like some kind of reception desk. What about this side? Mm, we're not allowed to go on a killing spree though. If I suck somebody, why don't you just like, you know... Why don't you just... Mm, I can't, I can't. If I suck on him, he's gonna get mad. But I want to be careful about how much blood we're using, too. That was probably the guy we saw through the wall. Okay, within the vents, we either go here... Oh, we can do this and just walk across, too. Oh, okay. That works. Oh no, I need that. There's something glowing there, you see it? Oh, I can't drop on this guy's head, though. He's gonna get mad. Maybe there's a door here. Okay, we somehow did it. Somehow did it. But now what? Are we okay here? We're right next to a window. Oh, we have Auspex, good. No, no, no! Oh, hold on. Dang it, I didn't get all of it. There was another place, right? Mm. Reminder, email for Janice. From C. Marshall. Is Marshall their boss? Just a reminder, Dr. Anders Johansson, aka the sarcophagus guy, will be working at the museum for the next few days. Show him the professional courtesy we show all of our guests, CM. That was mentioned on the ship too, right? I can't remember the name Johansson. Subject fetish from P. King at nmh.vtm. That statue on Daryl's workstation is creeping me out. I was working late the other night, and I swear, I thought I saw it move. This isn't another gag, is it? If it is, I don't think it's funny. Ham. Oh, okay. Statue on Daryl's workstation. Statue on Daryl's workstation. Okay. Noted. Where is Daryl? Virus alert! Read me! MAV has detected a virus in the attachment of this message. The virus has been quarantined, and the notice sent to adcxu.mail.net. Cool. Thanks, from JJ Elmster. Those keys you found? They're Larry's. I'll tell him you left them in the lost and found. And that's it. Oh man. Oh frick, I need to do Auspex again. By the way, I hear a camera near me. Museum acquires ancient sarcophagus. Well, at least we know it's here. Yeah, it's okay. I've got plenty of blood packs today, so I don't think I need to be afraid of using Auspex. Although it's still a waste because we could, uh... 
If we were faster earlier... Griff. View. Sales figures are unavailable at this time. Oh, wonderful. Now I really used it for no reason. <laughs> okay. Okay, this is- this goes outside. Good to know. Ah, that was a lost and found key. How did I get in? Did I have the key? Another key? I kinda wanna check out... This guy's been dozing off. Just the pantry? Is it the pantry? There's... No, this might be the server room. But we can't get up. Yeah, it's a one-way drop. That's fine, we're done. What have you been looking at? I've been walking all across. So... We know that the statue- hold on, where was it again? The fetish? It's at Daryl's workstation. What even is that password? I love Gabe. <laughs> it's not an exhibit then, it's on someone's workstation. So we gotta go into an office. Okay. Well, coming in here was a pretty good idea then, because now we know where the fetish is. The next step is actually locating it. So this was the bathroom. Okay. That guy is eternally peeing in there. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, oh there's multiple guys. Oh, this is the big door that we couldn't go through. Right, now we're back at the beginning. Yes, $18 for adults, students with student ID, $12, children $9, senior $9, members free, because members get ripped off, you gotta buy a membership card for $45. There's a lot of people here suddenly. Have we looked at everything on the bottom floor? The workstation seems to imply that... I mean, we gotta go to an office. Frankly. Yeah, this is back the way we came from before, right? No? Wait, where are we? Oh, this looks promising. Daryl's workstation. Dork? Jan found them buried in the sofa downstairs and turned them into the lost and found. Stop leaving your damn keys all over the place or else next time I'm demanding a finder's fee. JJ. Yeah, that's gotta be the... the museum basement key that we found earlier. We haven't been to the basement yet and we also haven't been to... the roof yet. God, there's so much to do. No! I thought that was gonna be the fetish. Well, Daryl's workstation isn't here. But here's the basement. 